In this video, I'll be walking you through what sections are and how you can use them to improve your Shogun pages. Let's get started. So a section is an element in Shogun that is primarily used to structure different areas of pages and to create overlays with image and video backgrounds. To show how sections work, I'll be using a blank page as a template to build off of. You'll find the section element over in the Shogun Builder. I'm dragging and dropping it over to any area on my page will create a standard section. And from here, you have a lot of options to customize. After selecting your section, over in the Builder, you can change variables like height and width to give more space to work with in the section itself. Selecting the full width option will ensure that the section stretches to the full horizontal space of the page. And you can also implement something like an image in any section element. Section elements also give you a number of customizations for backgrounds, allowing you to select either an image, color, or video as a background for the section you're working with. If you've selected an image as your background, you can adjust the size of the image. Selecting the cover option ensures that your image fills the entire section. If you have issues with the image getting cut off, this option might be the reason. Selecting contain ensures that the image will appear full size no matter what screen setting it's set to. And custom allows you to fully control the dimensions of the selected image. Scrolling down, I wanna highlight the parallax effect for backgrounds as well. Enabling a parallax effect allows the background to move at a slower rate than the foreground, essentially creating an illusion of depth to the page and giving content a 3D-like effect as viewers scroll down. Enabling and optimizing a parallax effect is a great way to engage with and impress your viewers. Once the height, width, and background have all been set, you can drag and drop other elements into your section element for further customization and placement. Clicking into each of these new elements will allow you to customize from the builder on the right-hand side. And as you continue to add and customize sections to your page, you'll wanna make sure that they all look aligned and uniform with the rest of the content. After clicking into your section, clicking top, middle or bottom under the vertically aligned content option will allow you to keep content organized and consistent. So to summarize, sections are elements that can be used for building out just about any area on any page. Sections can be resized, they can house colors and images, and they can be used as backgrounds for any area of the page as well. Sections can be used for hero sections, product lists, newsletter sign-up call to actions, and honestly, they can be used for just about anything you're looking to build on a page, since they're used to house and optimize most of the other available page elements. All in all, that's it for sections. That's all for now. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.